Hi everybody. Hi Neil. Hello John. Uh, you are, you're like my shadow, aren't you? I, eh? I'm always here behind you. <laughs> always behind me. <laughs> uh, we're in Devon today. We are at, where are we? We're at Fingal Glen. We're at Fingal Glen. Hopefully you can see the uh, sign behind us. There we go. Uh, the reason we're here is for probably, he's over there, I won't see him very well. There's a gentleman over there by that car. Wave, wave please gentlemen, there we go. Right. Um, we're, we're here at the invite of Rogue Golfers, that's Finton from Rogue Golfers, and you'll see the other gentleman in a minute. Uh, because they're, uh, well, Fingal Glen has an open day today. Yeah. Um, so we thought we'd come and have a look. It's one of those places I've never visited before. No, I've driven past it numerous times, seen the sign. This is the thing, it's on the A30 going up towards Exeter when you come from Cornwall. And all you do is you see the sign on the left hand side that says Fingal Glen yeah. Golf Hotel. So we thought it'd be a good time to come and see the place. They've, um, going to be honest, they, they probably struggled a bit after COVID and they've got themselves back in shape. Yeah. The place is looking really good. They've um, invested a lot of time, effort, probably money as well. Yeah. It's looking very nice out there. The course, we've been warned is a bit wet, but hey, isn't everywhere right now. Where you should have seen a set of my shoes. Found your ball, Neil. <laughs> I have, I found it, mate. I found your ball. Hang on. A little bit. Yeah, that's a, that, that's a bit plugged. We'll take some relief. Yeah, Winter win rules. Yeah. Yeah, we'll take some relief. Where is it? At yeah. The um, quick little tip: when you go and play at a place like St Q and you're up to your knees in long grass and your shoes are saturated, don't leave them in the car for four days out, five days after, is it? And get them out and try and get them on. Oh well. Newspaper. No. <laughs> Scrunch up some newspaper. I normally take up go inside and put them under a heater, but they were so covered in thick grass I couldn't do anything. So little tip for you, big oggy tip of the day. So it's just a little diary video today because we want to have a look around. The course is going to be packed. I believe the tea times have been started at eight o'clock. There's yeah. only a 10 minute gap between every tea time and they're on all day. They've got food going on. It's just a, a chance to take a look at the place. Yeah. So there'll be a little bit of B-roll of us on the course. Maybe we'll be able to film a hole, but that really will depend on how busy the course is. Um, but we'll do a little bit if we can, and then we'll have a chat with road golfers. Hey Neil, we're going to see how good people are with other cameras now. We're going to see the quality, uh, quality this, media this is, people. This is rushed, so we're not, we're not as good as you boys. Uh, yeah, he handles it well, doesn't he? Handles it well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Want to get them onto the channel because they've been keen to come on the channel for yeah. quite some time. They've helped film the uh, charity golf day for two years running, and they're actually taking part this year, which is brilliant. Yeah. I wanted them to take part and not just film for us. So they're going to be kind. They're going to come, what, buccaneers of a kind? We'll kind go, of buccaneer. Should we go rogue? We'll, we'll, go, rogue. Rogue. we'll go rogue. Uh, so they'll be helping out on the channel when we come up to Devon from time to time. Neil, not Neil, is not here today, although he doesn't live very far from here. So again, we may come and do a course vlog here. Bring Neil, not yeah. Neil, and maybe you as well. Because five, we'll, 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 we'll work Neil, out Neil, something. Neil. Someone can carry the camera, probably me. We're rambling. We're going to crack on because the weather's um, iffy. I think the coat might go in the bag. I'll get the coat in the bag if I were you. It's raining in Devon. Raining. Who heard of it? Let's get moving. Oh, road golf. I, I would zoom in, but I can't work zoom on this camera. It's a new camera. Probably glad I didn't. Did I go to the wrong flag? Wait, oh, was good. Yeah, wait, was good. Wrong hole. What did you, I was going to say, that's the wrong hole. I'm definitely pointing the wrong direction. The flag at the top there. Yeah. I just lost my bearings for a minute. John. Yeah, I thought you did, because I think it's over there we're playing. He was in such a rush. I went for that flag. You got that flag. So, what did we say it was? 100? Was it? Yeah, about, a ton, yeah. about 105. Yeah. About 105. About like there, mate. Oh, if only I could zoom in. Do we need to zoom in? Oh, on the green, about that far? It's about that far. It's a shame it wasn't here. Yeah, you took that, that would have been pretty good, wouldn't it? Cheers. Shall I go, shall I? I would suggest you go, yeah. I'm so much better behind the camera than I am in front of one. A little bit left, a little bit left. Off the bank. I'm, I'm glad we don't have a green camera today. 
Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, except for you. Well, so go on. All right, go on, John. Pop it on there. I don't need to. You're on there. Go, go. Yeah. Do you know, we, we have just filmed the whole before on, on hopefully on their channel. You'll see how appalling I have just played. That's my best shot of the day. The number, though. That was good. So I don't know what happened there, Neil. We have no. played appallingly so far today. Just okay. a, bit, a bit of a laugh today, just a bit of fun. Spooky hole. I got backspin, John. You got backspin? Got you can get backspin. tablets for that. The course is very wet, unfortunately. So we don't want to showcase too much of it today. We're going to come back in the summer. Or in a few weeks' time, maybe even, um, when it's dried out a bit more. And uh, we'll come and do a course vlog with them. It'd be nice to get road golf on the channel more often. Yeah, yeah such, a, such a great pair of lads. So, Jay's just going to chew on a bit of luck. Finton's still trying to find his ball, went a little bit wayward. Could be nice, could oh, be nice. Good, Jay. Very good. good, What Jay. a shot. Go on. That's all that all that simulator practice, mate. Well done. What a shot that is. <laughs> I knew someone wouldn't let the side down. Well done. Oh, and, and you found your stick on the ball as well. The one you lost from the last hole. Well done. Try that instead. I would. Give it a go. Yeah, good one. Good one. Isn't it amazing how always the second good shot's one. always so good? Oh. Get that. That's what I meant to do, John. Yeah, of course it was, yeah. They've, they've raised that a little bit, haven't they? They did, didn't they? Right, if you putt. Yeah, go on, I'll putt. So we're, we're rushing around. We don't have time. It's a busy course today, though. This open day is really popular, so we're just going to play for fun. Full from just after eight this morning. Every tee time booked. Yeah, not hard enough. It's really just a yeah. Little showcase a little bit of the course. All right. All right. Go on. Oh. Oh. Well done. Well, look at that. Eh? One for the Buccaneers. There you go. <laughs> oh. oh, Jay. I, I'm saying nothing. I'm, honestly, it happens, mate. First, first day of the season for you. There have been better shots than that today. That was a good one. I like that one. That one. No one. All right, go on, John. You finish it off. Doesn't really matter now, does it? You get a two and a three for the Buccaneers. Can happen. There we It'll go. It'll do. Beautiful, beautiful. It's almost like we knew how to play golf. You can work your magic on us. Can we get a decent pitch on us? That takes some doing. Oh, definitely, yeah. Hi, Neil. Would you like to do the introductions? Because obviously you're here as a well, presenter. Just being, um... you're, you're being, oh yeah, you're being um, yeah, stuffed. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, Hello. Being stuffed. There we go. Nice. Thank you. Uh, we just have our photographs taken for the Rogue Golfers little video that they've uh, created. I'd just like to say, please don't go and watch. <laughs> <laughs> well, I know, I know what happens. On it. Yeah, no, no, it's, it is a bit of fun. Uh, to be honest, thank you very much for inviting us up today. Nice uh, to I saw the details about the Figal Glen Open Day and I was really interested. It's been one of those courses that we, Neil and I have never been to, but we wanted to come and take a look at it. It's quite cool. And uh, you were obviously coming to today and I've noticed that you've been doing a lot of promotional stuff here for Fingal Glen recently. Yeah I mean we're lucky enough they've got the sim here so through the winter we can use the sim and um, yeah we're just trying to help them out they're trying to grow the course at the moment it's very much sort of hotel based at the moment yep. so they're trying to bring the course along to match sort yep. of the, the hotel side of things. And obviously from when we first started to come in here to now the new greenkeepers have really Good made job. a massive difference already. Phenomenal. Um, everybody that we spoke to is really looking forward to seeing just how far this place can come the summertime. Yeah, come down so. to Fingal Glen, guys, because all the staff here are really friendly. They're welcoming to everyone, all skill set, all levels. 
from kids up to elderly people. Well, I mean, people on the channel know that I like to find courses that aren't um, get, go in a bit. I'm trying to go in. Yeah, get, a bit get the mic in. Yeah, get I'm your mic get in. The microphone in. Uh, yeah, pe people know that I like to find. Uh, how can we say it? Kind of grassroots golf and courses that aren't so well known to, to yeah. people in the southwest. And obviously, I've had quite a close association in the last couple of years of Wellbet Manor, which is another Devon course, which was on its knees, uh, no disrespect. And then they turned the course around, they turned the hotel around. And here, and I will be honest, I'm always honest, they struggled here for a while. Big time. Yeah. But they seem to have invested, they seem to put a lot of effort and time in now. They're bringing some more experts in. And the hotel, we've, the bits we've seen so far, it looks fantastic. The course looks really good for the conditions, for the yeah, weather. The greens have really come on leaps and bounds, and that's been its biggest downfall, especially last year. Yeah. yeah, so we want we want people to see more of these kind of courses. Don't always just go to the big name courses in the southwest because there are lots of real lovely little hidden gems, and this well, this will be with, one of them. Especially with how many golf courses are now like closing mm. and stuff like that, it's yeah. important to Warren. use them to. Yeah. Well, you them lose them or lose them, them aren't they? Don't yeah. You? Yeah, because we, we've noticed a few courses that are dying and I've obviously found a couple of them and they're literally going and we've known a few that have gone already. Yep. And we need to keep these places easy, keep these places going, get the up, keep growing on them, get the memberships growing on them. And just if you don't want to be a member, just come and pay and play and just use them regularly because without that, we're going to run out of places to play. Definitely. So, yeah. so uh, we're going to take a look around. We've, we've played one hole with you. We've yeah. played two holes, one on your channel. Please don't watch. Um, although you did very well, yeah, I will say. Um, so on, your, on the hole you did. Yeah, I don't know what channel. happened there. It's phenomenal. It just yeah. considering went, the fact it was we, the next hole we after. Lost it. We lost it. We went. We, we totally lost it. But you know. I, th I think we deliberately we do that. We kind of said, "Oh, your channel will play really badly, and on our channel you play really badly." Possibly. Yeah. yeah. So possibly. these two lads will be on some of the course yeah. vlogs that I'm going to create as part of the Devonshire Quest, as opposed to the Cornish Quest as well, um, but also some other fun stuff. Excellent. Yeah, and uh, thank you very much for the support for the golf day that you've done for the last couple of years and you will be playing this year which is really good we're looking forward to it we will so be man, yes. man Dow, good good uh, cause as well done well done john thank you very much doing well man get the plug in for the golf day yes we'll get going see you a bit later lads take, take care thank cheers you. so the road golfers have gone back they're doing some other filming on behalf of the place itself yeah yeah um so we're going to just play another hole hole 13 yeah little par three and then we're going to make our way back get changed into some slightly drier footwear and yeah stuff yeah well my, actually my feet aren't too bad they're quite no. dry but winter so golf a lot of mud to come off these yeah um and then we're gonna get some food hopefully yeah so we've got 128 yard par three okay it's playing about 112 down the hill give it a go so really running and gunning today so no shot, like making new connections today yeah Networking day. Well, which we've done. We've already done that. Sometimes you have to do that as a golfing YouTuber. You have to make connections. Yeah. Leaving, there's a lot of stuff that goes on behind the scenes when you're being a YouTuber, honestly. Not just playing golf every week or even when you can. That looked right on it. Right on it. Oh, 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 that, oh, oh, was that oh, oh, this camera's still going. So, we oh. want to do you want to zoom down? Zoom down, oh, what's that? just and I'll set up. I'm not sure how much ooh that oh. was, but it was it was that's, pretty you. That's pretty you. Now, I've got to be slow when zooming in, yeah, because it's this new camera, we're not going to got it yet, have we? But that's that's a bit typhoo, that. That's not far off, mate. Wow. I'm sorry I couldn't zoom in, because like I said, it's just a new camera. But I'm in shock. I don't, I'm not going to play now, so leave it at that. That'll be it. Lovely ending for the video. Thank you very much, Neil. Bye-bye. <laughs> Please subscribe. That's a good strike as well. I think it's just tied left on the... Run. Yeah, just at the front there. Yeah, there's no curry today, obviously. Very wet. But we'll have a look, Neil. Yeah, wow. Pretty better have a look. Now, Neil is very close to the flag, but that's a very pretty part of the course. Now, I don't know what hole that is over there, but you can see this is a very pretty little course. Jeff needs the weather to improve. That's all it needs. Bit of patience. We'll be there soon. Neil? Yes, John. Can you find my ball, mate? Uh... Yeah. Oh well, where's yours? 
On the green. We'll have a look, shall we? Yeah. yeah. Go on. Bring your putter. I've got it ready. Well done. Forget my shot because yeah. quite frankly, it's all about the nearest shot, yeah. Well, that's the closest we've had to a hole in one on the channel, isn't it? Yeah, I think that's the closest we've had to a hole in one. A little bit more zoos on it. Well done. Repair the mark. Sure, I've got that ball. Sure, didn't go in the water. <laughs> Should we tap it in for a birdie? No, I tap it in for a two. Do you know what? That's. Oh, I don't want to. Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh, look at that. Oh, so you've got to laugh, haven't you, lads? There you have. Oh. That's a lovely par, mate. Well done. <laughs> yeah. Well the done. lads are there winding me up. It was still a bit of a laugh, wasn't it, eh? That's it. Yes, that is road golfers. We thought we got rid of them, but they're still hanging around. Yeah. So let's, let's make our way back after that slightly disappointing, but almost amazing finish. But did they do it on purpose? No, well, you probably did. Right, Neil, you got your hat back on. I got my hat back on. Uh, we're now in the car park. Yeah. Not a bad old day. Got a bit of mud on your face, mate, but that's all right. Yeah, no, oh, that's it. Oh, scrubbing no, the boots. Scrubbing the shoes. Leave it on there. Boots, yeah. football boots. Scrub the uh, shoes. <laughs> yeah, scrub your shoes, everybody, please. Yeah. Another winter golf tip. <laughs> so, uh, what do you think today? Um, the course looks good. Yeah. I think you've just got to ignore the conditions. Oh, absolutely. The, I think that's the situation right now with everywhere. Much. Most of like England um, has had poor weather, so yep. we've been struggling with that. But take out the conditions, the greens, considering what some of the rough was like and the fairways were like, wet wise, damp wise, um, they were rolling pretty good. I'm nodding my head in the background. Yeah. The greens are really good. The greens were good. Um, I've heard that you know, they've done a lot of work on them and it shows. It's going to yeah. be really good again in a few weeks' time with a bit of dry weather. With fingers crossed. We're all fingers crossed and there's no snow bomb so, coming or yeah, whatever they yeah. call it. Uh, food was good. Food was Facilities good. Facilities look really good. they got a fantastic kind of, I almost feel like a social club club area now. Yeah. They've got like pool tables and, and darts and those kind of things as well as the bar. That and the restaurant. used to be the driving range, apparently. Yeah. So they've boarded all that out you've got a nice big bar area seating little putting green uh track man simulator in there as well um facilities look really good yeah they've certainly, they've certainly yeah. been invested in the place and uh, it's now a lot more than just a hotel yeah it's becoming what what the signs have always said it was a golf hotel that's it i mean as i said it, we just gotta ignore what the weather's been like and how it's damp underfoot because you can't Nothing we could do, nothing they could do yeah, about that. Place with potential right yeah. now. Oh, they're, definitely. They're looking to grow their membership yeah. as well. I think the membership fees are pretty good. Yeah. I won't give quotes on here in case people watch this in two years' time and go, oh, what the price isn't that. Yeah. Uh, but I know it's very competitive no, for the area. Um, yeah, definitely. Road yeah, golfers yeah. are certainly very keen on the place. And yeah. I said they're, uh, of course, they're doing that I think we'll, we'll grow. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. So if you get an opportunity, go watch road golfers, go over and take a look at what they do. And um, go and subscribe to them too. We're trying to grow as many of the smaller channels in the southwest as we can to come support. Yeah. Thank you very much, everybody. Please subscribe, please hit the notification bell, do all that stuff. And uh, we'll see you on another golf diary very soon. Another diary in the world. And I am here, all right, just behind camera. Bye, Neil. See you again.